Hello everybody, it's Kitty Corp here and today I'm going to show you how much damage C4 does in Rust. Now this is mostly for new players, but even if you don't know and you've been playing Rust for a long time, it could help you out in either way and I may do rockets. Not positive, but I think that this will just be a C4 episode. So I made these bases really quick. They're just one by ones with specific doors and stuff. So right here we have armored with an armored door, sheet metal with a sheet metal door, stone with a sheet metal door, then we have wood with a wood door, and then we have twig with a rainbow door, which I had. Because some people, if you're new, you don't really know what a uh, twig is. Like when I first started, I didn't even know how to like get a building plan, which is the funniest thing. So basically, I'm going to show you how much C4 you're going to need for one wood door. So obviously, C4 does not do splash damage. At least I don't believe it does. Rockets usually do. But I prefer rockets because if you use four rockets, it's like as you see right here, it took one C4 to get into this base, which is for one wood door. So I'll just show you guys what it's like for a... Um, wood wall or twig wall actually so I'm sure you guys can already guess it but I'll just show you now just in case you don't know so I mean uh, twig is pretty useless but if you take a um, let's just get a hatchet if you just take a hatchet and let's say you go up to someone's base even though this is hard side when you're outside it'll still take about 20 hits and then you'll finally get in but if you're on the inside it'll only take about three to the wood. So we got ourselves a wood door here. Let's see how many this is. One door is one C4. Obviously you know that from the last one. Now let's see how much it is for one wood wall. does it 250 damage which is pretty nice and a one rocket does a half of that so if you want to match up one c4 you need two rockets so now let's see sheet metal now as you see sheet metal door has 250 so if you want to raid someone all you would need is one c4 so let's see if that's what you think Since that this is 500, do you think that it'll still only take one C4 since the sheet metal door is, or will it take two? Let's see. Yeah, um, you guys are probably wrong. It's going to take two, but if you guess two, it'll be right. And uh, since we've got another sheet metal door over here, obviously going to be one. And as some of you are probably thinking right now, oh, this is so stupid, we already know from like the first three. Yeah, well, some people don't know. So it was one for that. Now, how many do you think it is for a um, sheet metal? Do you think it's one, two, or three? Some of you saw that it was at like 300 something, but it, since it was already like a little damaged, it did a little bit more for some reason. So that's why when you guys are on servers, people say that sheet metal is the same as stone. And uh, personally, and uh, physically, stone is better because first of all, you can't see through it. Sheet metal, if someone's rain, they can see through it. So if I place like let's say a chest in here, they could probably see that. If they had like a boost or something, they can see that chest right there be like, oh, this is loot or something. Now coming on to the armored. An armored door has 800 health. Let's see how much C4 it takes. Well, 
one C4 down, and as many as there are to go. So, as you see, for some reason, it did 400 damage. Now, let's see again. This is, C4 is pretty insane, but obviously I prefer rockets, but that's my own opinion. Two C4. That's pretty good. So, one armor door equals either one stone wall or one sheet metal wall. Now, the walls for armored have a thousand health. So let's throw one on. How many do you think that will be? Even though sometimes it can do sp specific damage, you don't really know how much it's going to do sometimes. So let's go on the inside. Looks like that. So it usually does 250 damage, somewhere around there. It just went down 400. So let's throw it on again. Magic touch is three C4, and um, that's a lot of fucking gunpowder. If you think about it, four satchels is only uh, or is twelve. A lot of gunpowder, especially for vanilla. But uh, there it is, everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe if you are new. And don't forget to tell your friends if you do enjoy this channel. And I will talk to you all later. Peace. Uh, you, you, you.